Uh, and another thing that we're hoping to include, depending on the weather, um, which, you know, in today we may rethink, uh, is the outdoor early weather. So again, just kind of getting people uh, up and about, giving them an opportunity to meet the other people that are at the event. Uh, and so we've been talking with um, the RAU to go on their RAU Amble, which is a walk around campus to take a look at the things that they're doing to support kind of the environment and uh, the journey to net zero. Another key issue, given the focus of the event, is sustainable food. And again, we're working closely with the RAU, uh, and I know from past collaborations as well that the RAU are doing a lot of work on ensuring that the food they provide is sustainable and it is a commitment that they share on their website. Um, so we are talking at the moment with one of their chefs to ensure that uh, everyone will have a tasty lunch and optional dinner um, should they choose to stay. And importantly as well, as Damien mentioned, we want to move from a competitive kind of Dragon's Den style pitching of solutions to a collaborative process of ideation and solution building. So rather than having people arguing with one another, we're there to facilitate a, a constructive environment. So giving people that opportunity, that space to share their thoughts um, without kind of feeling that they might be argued with. Uh, and essentially as well, um, having that feedback panel as a supportive and constructive um, space uh, in which people can hear from those with some expertise in the area of food farming and land use and also to hear back from their peers as well on the feasibility of their solutions. 